Hello lovely people, it's another beautiful week and of course this is Social Media Trends right here on VNTV. On this show we get to bring you what is trending during the weekend. We gather everything and bring it to you right here on the show. My name is Makafui and let's kick start on today. Today on Social Media Trends, uh, Davido has come out to uh, give us the reason why he's always singing about women. I know. All of you was, were wondering and besides he's not the only one but he's the only one that has come out to confirm that the reason why he thinks about women he said something which I'm going to read he said most of my music is about girls I have two daughters and most of the people around me are females so that's what I sing about that's what I experience it's not really a philosophy it's just making music based off what how I was raised and being authentic to that so that's it the video has explained and made it clear to all of you who were wondering why the video is always thinking about girls you know he said it is because of how he was raised now moving forward Regina Daniels I know she's always in the news this girl is always making her way to the news and this time around she said in a video that she has a crush on Brenna boy I'm like what I mean a question came into my head can a married woman crush on someone is it a crime or it's just like I like him so I'm just crashing on him well she said this in a recent video she posted on her YouTube channel Regina Daniels TV check this out well I already have the questions so my first question is who is my crush <laughs> um, Bonaboy <laughs> the ganja bone <laughs> mm. Relationship, one second. I think it should be this way. Number nine. Married. <laughs> Then now still in Nigeria, false the bad guy has come to confirm that cyber crime is giving Nigeria a horrible image. Not if, not just in Nigeria, but outside of Nigeria. Now he further added that though his colleagues and every other guy who is involved in this Yahoo thing is uh, backlashing him and all of that, he will still call a spade a spade. That it is not good. He understands uh, people are struggling. There's no job. There's no work. People are really suffering. But at least some. Some of them work their ass out to make money. Some of them struggle and then go from head to toe, morning, evening, just to get something in their pocket in a legal way. But most of the guys have decided to do this Yahoo thing, get money from someone in an illegal way. He said it is still not good and it is giving Nigerians a bad name, not just in Nigeria, but outside of Nigeria. He further added that if you're going to live your life, it is just one life you're going to live. So if you're going to live this one life, making someone suffer because you took something from him or her, um, you're going to pay for it. Yes, that's what he needs. You're going to pay for it. So you got, yeah, he said, you guys who are involved in this thing should at least find yourself a better job, make money a legal way, and enjoy your life. Make your life very simple for you. All right, so we're back to Ghana, where Tracy Success, who doesn't, we know she doesn't really come in the news, but this time around, she said that Sakode doesn't come to bed early, and people kept wondering, why is Sakode not going to bed early? Hmm, I know you're also thinking, but she said it is because Sakode works so much because he stays in the studio and comes to bed like 2 a.m., sometimes 3 a.m., 4 a.m., wow! And uh, upon posting this, she uh, posting this on her Twitter handle. Actually, she got so many comments, sweet comments. One was like, "Go join him in the studio," and then one was like, "That's why he's still the king of African rap." King Sakodie bowed down to greatness. So yeah, we are urging Tracy. Since you've gotten yourself involved in it, you should just keep supporting him for Sakodie to work hard. Sakodie, you know, work hard for him to continue uh, taking Ghana to the world, taking Africa to the world. And on our last social media trend of today, uh, Messi Johnson is set to launch a new kitchen talk show in July. Now it looks like all most of the people are engaging themselves in, they are trying to show you that they are good cooks. So y'all should watch out for uh, Mercy Johnson's new kitchen talk. She's, she's like a chef. She's going to teach women how to cook 
good food for their men. So guys, that's all we have for today. Follow us on our social media handles at Facebook at VNTV and on Instagram at VNationTV. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel to get a repost of all the exciting programs we have right here on VNTV. If you miss, subscribe to get a repost. Be the first to watch every show we post. And also, uh, follow me personally on my Instagram handle at mag underscore coffee. And many thanks to the man behind the camera, Mr. Femi. I'm always supposed to say this. And also, log on to our website www.vnationtv.com for more trendy stuff oh lest i forget happy is it belated yeah happy belated father's day to all fathers mr femi happy father's day to you happy father's day to my boss to my daddy to every potential father to every man like every man who is watching right now thank you so much for choosing to watch vntv catch you same time next week bye <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,